We've just got him out of his pit now. It's Eggsy from GLC. How you doing? Yo. <laughs> Morning, Eggsy. How you doing? You sound a bit worse for wear. Oh, no. Listen to that. It's, well, I was going to say it's smoky nightclubs, but not anymore, man. Yeah. What have you been doing to your lungs? Uh, I've been screaming down a microphone for several days. Um, I haven't slept for about six days, and uh, it's pretty good. We're just we're, we're we're on the road to hell, and everybody's coming with us. <laughs> Forget GLC. You need some TLC. Yeah, oh, that's it. That is rubbish. You you can step away from the microphone in shame for the next one. Um, <laughs> so, are you? Do you share a tour bus, all of you, or do, is there like two or three? No, there's there's one tour bus. Everybody's in bed oh, at the moment. That must you? be stinky. I've got a little request for you, Eggsy. Yeah. yeah. Now, Maggot looks a lot like my boyfriend, Leighton, who is also from South Wales, right? Right. right. Can you go and wake Maggot up? Because I really want to <laughs> chat with him. <laughs> no, he we've actually, got Eggsy. He actually punched someone in the face the other day. Like, he's, he's, if, you, if you wake him up, that's it. He'll go crazy. Is know? it like a violent ninja type reaction? Yeah, yeah honestly. <laughs> But if it, if it makes you feel any better, I'm naked as well. Oh, oh, that's, that's beautiful. That is a yeah. beautiful image. So, so you know, you say you've been uh, shouting down at the uh, mic. You're in Oxford tonight. Can we expect you naked on stage or is that too much to ask? Um, you might not get me naked, but you might get a song about Kelly Osbourne and oh. the corned beef. And that's pretty, that's pretty damn good. Now, we listened to that yesterday and I was tempted to put it straight on our X list. But our boss was not up for that, surprisingly. I think possibly due to the... Uh, the, sl- <laughs> the connotation. The naughty lyrics. <laughs> yeah, the the, uh, the content is a little bit fruity, as they say. Do you know uh, it, whether she knows about it? Because like, if I heard you guys had done a song about me, I'd be like, wow, amazing. And then you listen to it and it's actually... I, I, I think she has. I, I'm not sure, actually. I think she has heard that we're, we've done the song. Um, <laughs> but it's kind of an ode. You know, you can't get close to these pop stars these days, you know. So the only way to really, really access that person in your life that you really want is to create them out of corned beef and then perform the act of love. Wait, Fantastic. Well, that's just the best thing ever. It's a little bit like American Pie. <laughs> yes, exactly. A little bit like American Pie with slightly more spam. Uh, on the kitchen table. Oh, yeah. this is uh, too too much for breakfast radio, I think, Eggsy. we got to pick your brains, though. Um, Rose, where's Leighton from, your boyfriend? He's from Port Talbot, or Port Toilet, should, you, should I say. Um, could you give us some suitably bad Welsh things that we can call him to insult him next time he pops into town to see Rose? <laughs> um... Well, you can say a bastard, but I don't know if, if you can say that on the radio. You might have to bleep no. that out. Yeah, we'll we'll get the bleep machine. We we have the bleep machine ready for you guys already. Oh, good, good, good. I'm trying my best not to be swearing. <laughs> Your new album, Asbo for Life. Um, what's the meaning behind that? You're too old in the tooth, or too long in the tooth now, all of you. Surely you're not out causing trouble. Well, technically, the uh, it's representative of. The uh, the album itself is the Asbo for Life. Once you've got it, you're never going to get rid of it. See? Not even on eBay. Magic. That's it. No, not even on eBay. Well, if you get it signed by us all, you might possibly put it on eBay. <laughs> That'd definitely push it, push, uh, push it up a few quid, I reckon. And uh, now yeah. we were reading rumours about the possibility after this album was done of a GLC movie. I- is there any truth in that? Because that would be amazing. There, there's, there's, there's been a lot of development work going on. Um, there's a couple, you know, there's something, uh, there's something based around a car park and a pair of roller skates, um, and a, a gang of uh, homeless people fighting against an evil business developer. But, um, I mean, we're just working on it at the moment. There's also talk of a zombie film. Um, you know, we, we're trying to work on something that involves sort of, uh, Deirdre Rashid from, uh, Coronation Street as well. But, uh, you know, it's, it's just finding the time. I mean, we've got to do this tour first. Yeah, exactly. Um, and you, um, you, I know you've released some stuff in the States, like uh, you released the album straight out of Newport. Do they get you in the States or are they, do they literally just are left speechless? There's a small contingent that... Uh, actually, we've had a few people from LA come over for these, for these, these shows on, this, uh, cool. on this, uh, this, this tour, which is quite nice, you know. But, yeah, there is... I think the general... American market want to see Britney Spears eating burgers <laughs> and having a breakdown. But, uh, there are there are some yeah, especially New York. New York there's a good vibe, which is good because I quite like New York. It's, Amazing. Uh, now, yeah, which one but, of GLC is the big Nando's fan? I, I, that's got to be about four of us. <laughs> We've got two in Oxford. Actually, there's one quite close to the O2 Academy where you're going to be playing tonight. So I suggest maybe we could have a little rendezvous for some uh, oh, hot yeah. chicken. 
Yeah, definitely. I'll give you a bit of hot chicken when we get there. Fantastic. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Amazing. You're not going to get better off than that all month, Rose. It's true. Yeah. And I've got a little message if you could pass on to Maggot for oh, me. Oh, stop with the Maggot yeah, stalking yeah. already. It's getting boring. Yeah. Can you can you tell Maggot I want to lick his face? <laughs> I, no, I will. I will. I'll tell him that. I'll tell him that. He's been getting very fruity on this tour. Very oh, fruity. That's so, what uh, you- any love juice action, he's more than happy to uh, to accept it. You know? do, do, the terrifying thing is, your promotions manager has actually given Rosie a ticket for tonight. So just tell Maggot to run for his life. Yeah, tell, uh, no, he won't be running. He'll be there. He'll be. He'll be. He'll be getting right in. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, hot juice. Yeah, hot chicken. Love juice action. Yeah. We cannot wait for tonight. Why should everybody else come down in five words? Why should they come down? I can't. Yes. I'm not very good at maths, but they should come down because it's a good party and. I tell you what, this tour has been really, really good. It's, it's been fantastic. We're doing a load of new stuff. Um, you can hear some of the old classics. And uh, if you're lucky, you get to drink some lager and watch Maggot undress with a lady afterwards as well. Oh, amazing. <laughs> All right, <laughs> rounding it off for you, Exy, so we can, you can get back to bed with just the memories of this beautiful interview in your mind. Uh, the question we ask everyone who comes on the show, it's a very serious one. Yeah. If you could replace your hand with a kitchen utensil, what would it be and why? It wouldn't necessarily. I'd like to replace it with a shotgun, but it's not really a kitchen. <laughs> no, I wouldn't cook with one of them. No, um, that would be messy. Um, I tell you what, I'd get is a, uh, a, 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 a a what's it called? A fruit smoothie maker. You know, a, a blender. Nice. Yes. I get a blender, and then I I put a cat in it and scare <laughs> children. Oi! Watch it. You can't do that to kittens. They don't like it. Oh, I suppose oh. I, I, well, I just put a, I put a food blender on the end and just chuck in various, various items to entertain people. You Cooking know? with Eggsy is going to be the next big thing on our screens, I think. Yeah, Ainsley God. Harriet, move over. <laughs> yeah, food poisoning from a microwave, bloody hell. <laughs> oh, Eggsy, thanks so much for talking to us this morning. You've been amazing. Please don't pass on any messages to Maggot, otherwise he'll just be hiring security. No, and, he's, um, he's, well, he's well up for it. He's well up for it. Tell him know? to look out for the sort of small blonde one with the dangerous looking her eyes at the gig tonight all right the the psycho the psycho the little psycho that's me yeah all right cool definitely cheers exy get back to bed now all right all right okay so don't forget nando's hot chicken love juice yeah i'm sweating in between the legs now (laughs) (laughs) thanks so much for talking to us it's been awesome cheers mate bye 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 bye